We call him Ms. Love Golsich. Get it? Get it? Golsich? Instead of, instead of Orsich? Get it? What is going on guys? It is DMG here and today we are going to be looking at the UEFA Europa League Man of the Match Mislav Orsic card. He got a hat trick against Tottenham to send his team through 3-2 on aggregate in the Europa League and genuinely especially just being an Arsenal fan I think that's hilarious first of all but well done to Orsic and you know considering that he had one of the better cards last year one of the more overpowered cards last year this card is also looking to be on that level. In terms of the player data, it's okay. He has the high, high work rates. He doesn't have four star skills. He does have four star weak foot, which is good, but I will say it is a little bit lacking. However, if you look at his in game stats, I'm pretty sure that we could probably overlook a few of those things. He obviously has tremendous pace. He has amazing stamina, so he can last all game. With a marksman chemistry style on him, he already has 99 agility, 96 balance. He goes up to 95 dribbling, would be 97 if he did have 10 chemistry and he also would go up to 99 finishing along with boosted long shots shot power and to top it all off he has a finesse shot and a lean body type so he should be able to shift around very well and hopefully hit a few finesse shots now unfortunately in terms of links he doesn't really have any seeing as though he doesn't play in a good league and also being from Croatia uh, unfortunately this year there aren't really a lot of good Croatian links there's obviously sugar which is a great card uh, and there's that road to the final Rebic who unfortunately won't get upgraded anymore and besides those two cards there's not really anything else you can really link him with that would actually be really really good so you're either gonna have to have him off cam or you're gonna have to put him in between a few icons like I did right here before we get into the video make sure to again like and subscribe if you haven't already give me suggestions about who you want to see me review personally I've been wanting to review this card since it came out so hopefully it does do well but but enough about that, let's get into the gameplay. First game, we have no single center back in sight. We love to see it. I'm assuming Kleiber is going to go in at center back. And then the Mbappe, the Neymar. We love it. We love it. Clap it in. I just realized I forgot to do instructions and player formations and stuff. Oh, okay. Hopefully he's in the right spot. Okay, what can you do? What can you do for me? Come on now. You obviously got the pace. You obviously have the pace. Oh my god, and then he can't dribble? Please tell me he's not one of those cards that's way worse than it seems. Okay, I see you, Orsic. The finesse, beautiful. There we go. I think he's going to be one of those players that positioning-wise is not going to be great because of his work rates. Good touch. Gets around. Ronaldo makes a run. And see, right there, right? Orsic just kind of stands. Oh, but then he bursts forward. Don't and then Dybala gets in the in the way without him trying. Beautiful, I love it. But Orsic, Orsic, beautiful. Okay, I keep saying beautiful as if these is, these are like well worked goals <laughs> instead of just random random goals for us to score. Little dink to Orsic. Uh, pen? God, what is happening? And then he just, and then he quits, and then and then he quits from it. Great. Okay. So Orsic, nine point two, two goals. We get assists from Duncan, and then obviously no assist for the one he just intercepted. He's been okay. I think he might be better if he just has a little bit more space to roam into, so he doesn't maybe have as much support. So we're gonna try him out maybe four four two, maybe in a four three three version two. I just want to check: Did Kyle Walker get a red card? No, it was a yellow for the tackle from behind in the box. It was okay. Next up, we have, okay, I'm assuming, is this like a road, road, road to glory here? Mendy, Varane, Gomez, Neymar, Rashford, Conte. Christ, you got enough people back there, bud? It's like the first second of the game. Oh, he's doing La Croqueta canceling as well. Ugh. He's not as great on the ball as I kind of expected. It could be the gameplay. I'm assuming it is the gameplay, to be honest. Oh, yeah, his dribbling is just not that great. He can turn well. Oh, but then he bursts through. Okay. Okay. That pace is nothing to be scoffed at. Oh, so we're just going to allow anything to... Look, look at him just doing all those skill move cancels. Like he's, like he's a good player. Come on now. Random through ball into Silas. And he's just... Yeah. As if he thinks he's a good player because of that. 
Look, 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 look how good I am. Oh, canceled. I'm, I think I'm better than... Am I better than Tex? I think I might be, actually, if I'm being completely honest. Or... Oh, my God. He's just... Po he kind of just pops up at the right time. The right time and place pretty consistently. Clap it in for the best player I've ever played against. One shot, 34% possession. Really, really good. 442, I'm assuming? 442 defense! How many scoops of G Fuel do you think he snorted before this game? That's an anonymous assistant pass. <sighs> like, it, it's gorgeous. We, we really love to see it. Oh my god. What, what, what a run by Orsich! And then he d and then the game just doesn't shoot. Hello. Hello, Orsich! Hello, Orsich! Thank you very much! For some reason, his dribbling's not very good. I'm not sure why. Because he's got the, the, uh, the agility, the balance, the lean body type, the actual dribbling with the marksman, right? But he shows up when he needs to, and it's great. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, let's go. The skill. The skill. So Orsic just helped us beat this biggest, the biggest scumbum I think I've played in a, in a very long time. And I don't say that lightly, all right? Orsic with two goals. He did not get an assist, but I think he did get the pass to an assist. Or at the very least, he was obviously very, very involved in that last attack. Did we get lucky in that last attack? Yes. Do I care? Hell no. Are you kidding against this bum? Absolutely not. Let's just take this in, please. Like, let's just take this in. This is a this is a great, great occasion. Capped off by Orsic being heavily involved in all of the goals. Just well done. Clap it in. It really does take something genuinely special to beat the park the bus meta spamming mechanic scumbums. Like, genuinely, that's that's not something that I say lightly, right? That is, it takes a genuine effort to do that. And Orsic nearly single-handedly did that for us. So again, well done to him. God, I'm so tempted to end the video right there just because of how high we just finished that game on, but I think we gotta play three games. That's a goal. So in the three games, four goals, one assist. I mean, he did well in each game, right? And again, you can't take away what he did in that second game as well against that scumbum. Fair enough, right? Fair play to that. And it's, it's just unfortunate that the gameplay is so bad where this guy's dribbling, 99 agility, 96 balance, 95 dribbling, lean body type, 97 acceleration. He feels like a truck. What I can rate is his run making, his motor, his engine is just consistently on, right? He's consistently making runs. He's consistently trying to get back on side and then make another run. So again, his motor is really nice. I do appreciate that. Now, in terms of the price, he's like around 200K. I'm sure that'll drop off a little bit, maybe fall around, you know, like 170, 180, somewhere around there. Is that a fair price? If you have the, you know, the icons to link him, then I think it's fine, right? If you really need a player like him. However, I do think there are players just as good because if you compare Orsic to, let's say, El Sharawi, right? I mean, they're, they're pretty similar. They're, they're pretty similar. And I think, um, yeah, El Sharawi also has the finesse shot trait. And obviously, there's going to be a lot of other players that can, that, that just have better links. So, you know, 200k you know try it right you can you can try him out for 200k i don't think that's an extortionate price but i do think it should be lower considering the fact that you need icons to link him so that is going to do it for this video guys hopefully you did enjoy it thank you guys so much for watching this has been dmg peace